Hello guys, welcome back to our journey through hobby shops in Japan. Now we will visit one of the hobby shops in Akihabara. It is called Trader. We will head to the fourth floor, which contains Kundam Plumwater. Hey, I know what you are thinking. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Before you go to the 4th floor, but the 6th and 7th floor. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share so you can keep exploring the wonders of our hobbies. Actually, not only Gundam Plum model on the 4th floor, there are Gundam figures, Kamen Rider and anime model kits. However, the majority of this video is about Gundam. The room is quite spacious. Moving around doesn't feel difficult here. All toys are neatly organized according to their type. There are some shelves that are specialized for Gundams. At first glance, it seems little. But here I found many condoms that are difficult to find in out of stores. Raider has a good selection of Kundams. Not just the newly released Kundams but many limited series are sold here. You can find regular Kundams here, though not many. There are many limiteds and premium bundle series that you can find as well. And completed with Metal Robot Tamashi and Metal Peel. Honestly, there aren't many Kundam stores in Tokyo that have such a comprehensive lineup.
Don't come here if you are looking for regular condoms because Ryder is basically a second-hand item shop. People come and sell items to traders, then resell them. That's why of course there are more limited series here. This shop is probably similar to Surugaya and Otachu Akihabara. Although compared to the other two, this shop is less in number of items sold. But I highly recommend trying this shop and see what collections they have. That's why I include this shop in one of the top 10 Chukundam shops in Tokyo. You can see a video about it at the link listed. This shop is also a must visit if you are a fan of Kundam figures from Metal Robot Damashi and also Metal Build. There are many interesting and rare collections on sale here. For the price, overall I think the price is quite reasonable. Stay all within reasonable limits. So, don't be afraid to run out of money here for buying offer price items. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the Japanese hobby shop. Stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of our hobbies. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. See you next time for more contents from Japan. Cheers!